Welcome back to another daily video of Hypixel Skyblock content on the Zach Playzan channel. Today, Hypixel Skyblock as per usual, but today we're going to be talking about how to prepare for the brand new mayor that's going to be elected in roughly three days' time. That mayor is, uh, it's Jerry, man. I, I knew they were going to do this eventually when they started the special mayor program, but um, I kind of just hoped I uh, was lying to myself and I hope this day would never come. So we're going to go ahead and take a look at what his perks are this video, as well as how to prepare for each of them and kind of take advantage of the mayor as much as possible. If you're a fan of Hypixel Skyblock content and you uh, enjoy watching the videos that I put out here on the channel on a daily basis, then make sure you guys subscribe. It doesn't cost you a single thing and you can always change your mind. I'm trying to reach 100,000 subscribers by the the end of the year and i know we can do it right now we're on the road to 70k and if you guys could be a part of that that would be absolutely amazing also uh leave a like because uh that, that'll be nice so currently the election process is underway there are three days and nine hours left at the time i'm recording this clip and as you can see uh man there he is jerry i oh, why <laughs> you this guy man i don't know what the admins why the admins are so obsessed with jerry the meme's dead it's just he's here all the time everywhere i look i just see this 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 is what my dreams are haunted by on a daily basis but anyways we're gonna we're gonna take a look at what his perks are he's winning the election by 95.6 percent of the vote even though there's a really good two perk marina that i'm almost tempted to vote for also the mining fiesta and earn two times mining experience on public island both these mayors would win easily if they were on their own without jerry here who is a special candidate so let's take a look through its three perks or four if you count this is a special candidate so its first perk is perk apocalypse activates all perks of another mayor every 18 skyblock days which is every six hours so this is going to be ridiculous and we're going to talk about why in a little bit here and uh, honestly a very exciting perk that i i cannot wait to use next we have stat apocalypse increases all your stats by 10 percent so i was looking at this and uh i'll show you guys why that's overpowered because there's so many stats this this helps out almost everyone in anything that you're doing on the server so we'll talk about that as well and then jerry apocalypse reveal hidden jerrys from logging farming mining and killing mobs so I'm also going to talk about what I think that's going to be as well. Obviously, just speculation. But if you're curious about what my thought is on that, then uh, make sure you guys watch through to the end. So let's break this down perk by perk. So perk apocalypse, no pun intended, perk by perk. Anyways, activates all perks of another mayor every six hours. So that means that one hour or one of these times every six hours as i said so one of these times we might get a three perk marina which is the extra sea creature chance 50 percent more fishing xp and the shark events and then another time we might get a mining fiesta with double mining xp or we might even end up with foxy which schedules an even extra event or diaz where you get bank interest and increases daily npc buy limits there's a bunch of mares that we can see perks from and so there's a few ways that you guys should try and prepare for that perk first let's focus on the event mares for example example if we get the three perk marina during one of those times definitely make sure that you have your fishing setup ready to go make sure you have your fishing pets as well ready to go and if you need to buy any better fishing rods make sure you have those available as well i'm gonna be using my rod to see when i am actually doing the shark fishing so just make sure that you have a good setup to go for fishing when this perk or this mare is elected for like an hour period it's it's gonna be weird i'm not sure how long like do they stay in the office for six hours then is it like six hours of shark fishing and like marina or is it for like one hour every six hours i have a lot of questions about this and i'm excited to see what actually happens for this because if it's six hours of each mare being cycled through throughout those five days this could be very overpowered and it's gonna be really fun to grind out some of the things that i've wanted to grind out also if coal gets elected for example make sure that you have like a mineral set ready to go or whatever you mine in make sure you have your stonk ready to go as well as a silverfish pet so that you can take advantage of the fiestas if you're trying to get xp obviously go to the end you get a ton of mining xp from just walking around in circles getting a bunch of endstone you get tons of xp if you want to make some money go to i recommend the deep caverns or the gold mine and mine ores so that you can get some refined minerals and you can sell those on the bazaar those still actually go for a decent amount of money as you can see 230 7k on the sell offer so there's still some really good money to be made there as well and then there's also what was actually one of our most recent mares mare diana if she gets elected make sure that you're ready to go with your ancestral spade your griffin pet your sword of revelations if you have one um anything that can kind of help you in that event towards killing mobs i also use my daedalus axe if i get them really low try and get some more magic find out of it and honestly just make sure that you're prepared for any type of event that might be thrown our way in that time especially if you want to optimize it as much as you can if you're kind of someone who just casually grinds then uh i don't know you can kind of just go with the flow but i'm gonna try and take advantage 
of every perk or any every moment of Jerry because special mares only come once every eight skyblock uh, years, which is about 40 days in real life time. So a little over a month. And so I definitely want to make sure that I can take advantage of them um, as much as possible. Quickly, let's move on to the next perk, Stat Apocalypse increases all stats by 10%. So this is really good for many reasons. So for example, if we get Mare Marina for like a six hour span and like fishing is up, you can get an extra 10% sea creature chance because I'm assuming that they're talking about every single possible ability. And so I hope they are. Also, one thing that's gonna be really overpowered the skyblock year of Jerry being elected is Yeti fishing. The reason why I say this is because you're gonna have an extra 10% magic find and you're also gonna have an extra 10% pet luck and a 10% sea creature chance. So it's gonna be like, it's gonna be a lot better. It's gonna increase a lot of different stats that are very needed when it comes to actually fighting um, yetis and trying to get baby yeti pets. So if you plan yeti fishing, um, definitely do it during this mare because I think it's gonna be ridiculously overpowered and we might even see some new records in terms of like um, pet drops this during this skyblock year. So it's gonna be really interesting to see. For everyone who isn't gonna be grinding out the different mare events, for example, if you play dungeons or if you're grinding slayers still, or if you're working on different skills, this is still gonna be a really good perk for you guys as well. Plus 10% to all your stat boosts means basically everything. You're gonna be 10% uh, healthier. I mean, your health, your defense, strength, speed, uh, crit chance, crit damage, intelligence. Intelligence, that could be very big for dungeons, having a lot more mana, especially when going into some of those floor seven boss fights. That could be pretty big as well. Bonus attack speed, sea creature chance, magic find, pet luck, ferocity, and ability damage. So you're actually gonna be doing 10% more damage as well, like from abilities on top of extra strength and crit chance and crit damage. Overall, you're just gonna be a, a buffed, man. It's gonna be a quite ridiculous perk to see for five days. This last perk is where um, there's a lot more speculation. Jerry Apocalypse reveal hidden Jerry's from logging. I assume they mean foraging, farming, mining, and killing mobs. So this is quite interesting. So I think, let's say I'm grinding slayers and I'm killing zombies. I have an odd chance if I kill a zombie that it's gonna spawn the Jerry. Whether it's just gonna stand there and do absolutely nothing as Jerry usually does, I have no idea, but it could also be overpowered and maybe give you some coins or some stats or even some more buffs for the course of the five days. I have no idea what to expect from finding random Jerry's. For all I know, it might tell me about an update from like seven months ago, like the Jerry on my island does. So I have no idea what to expect from this perk. And I want you guys to let me know in the comments down below what you guys think this perk is gonna do. What do you think it's gonna give you something? If it's just gonna go hmm every single time I see one or if it's actually gonna have a purpose or not. So let me know in the comments down below because I'm really curious what your guys thoughts on it. Maybe I'm misunderstanding it, but Reveal Hidden Jerry's is just, it, it sounds so weird, I don't know. When it comes to investing with this mare, honestly, I wouldn't invest in anything. I think the market, I, I don't even know what's gonna happen. I don't know what you should invest in. I wish I had some for you guys. With Derpy, I did, and if you invested with me then, you would have made a ridiculous amount of coins because I, I bought a little bit and, uh, well, I made like, 40 mil from that little little tip I gave you guys in the derpy prepare video. But I have nothing to tell you guys. I mean, maybe like a couple things for different mare events that might happen. Other than that, there's not really much you can do to prepare for this type of thing. Overall, just make sure that your gear and your personal like stuff that you have on you is prepared. I wouldn't really be too much too worried about trying to make coins right off the bat. There might be money making methods once the mare actually starts. But other than that, I really don't have anything for you guys right now on investing. No matter what happens though, I'm pretty sure that's gonna be a very interesting five days here on Hypixel Skyblock. So if you play Hypixel Skyblock, definitely make sure that you log in during these five days and check it out. I think Jerry, it's gonna be one to remember. Honestly, all the special mares that we've had so far, I can remember very well, Scorpius, Derpy, they've all been chaotic. And uh, so I'm excited to see what Jerry has to offer and hopefully you guys are as well. Either way, that's gonna be the end of today's episode. If you guys are new around here, make sure you guys subscribe for more daily Hypixel Skyblock content. You already know once the new Dwarven Mines update comes out, I'm gonna be covering the hell out of that update. So make sure that you guys are prepared with post notifications on. Leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy. I hope you guys are gonna be ready for Jerry. I know I will be. And without further ado, I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, take care and peace. <laughs>